Hi guys, it's Carrie from Garden Rudiments. Stay tuned as I show you where you can get these great plans to build your own potting bench. My husband built this great bench for me. It's made out of two by fours. It cost us around $90 to build it with all the lumber and uh, the screws that we used. It is a great bench. The place to go to get your plans to build this bench is called How to Build a Potting Bench Workbench. It's the title of the video and it's by PCO Woodcrafting. And I'll put a link to PCO Woodcrafting so you can get your own plans to build this bench. We made a couple of modifications. In his video, he put um, a ledge, an extra shelf, whatever you want to call it, here on the back side of it. I didn't do that because I'm going to be using this bench to do a lot of my filming. So I needed to be able to stand behind it like I am now instead of having some, something that's blocking that. Uh, also, instead of putting just um, the little casters on that you would put on your furniture to, like, to protect your uh, wood floors, we went ahead and put casters on it because I tried to move it by myself and it was so heavy I couldn't move it. So it, it is a very sturdy, very heavy workbench. So we put rolling casters so that I could move it around uh, the back patio here. And then we're going to be building a greenhouse this year and this will eventually go in the greenhouse and we'll take those casters off. But uh, putting it on the casters has made it a little taller than I wanted it to be. Of course that wasn't in the plan. I don't want to cut the legs off because it will go in the greenhouse and it won't be on casters. So right now, I love it the way it is and it works for me. Um, this patio has just a little bit of slope so it may look like it's sloping downhill a little bit but it's not, it's level. Um, you can see I've got my top workbench and then I have a level underneath for storage and I also put plants under here also. But the gentleman that has the YouTube channel who does a great job of going step by step on how to build this. Um, you can also go to his website which is PCOWoodcrafting.com and you can print off the complete instructions. My husband said this was a great project, it was easy, he had no troubles doing it and he's, he's not a woodcrafter, he's not a woodworker. He just loves to do things like this and um, this was something I really needed and most people do, they need somewhere to work and I thought this would be a great project for us and it has been. Um, so again, the only difference is that where we changed our plans, we didn't put the back on it. We didn't put a shelf on it um, that was raised up. I needed to be able to film behind it and we put rolling casters on it so that I could roll it around my patio. But anyway, please check out that link. It's called PCO Woodcrafting and the title of his video is How to Build a Potting Bench Slash Workbench. I highly recommend it. This, this is just working great for me and I think you will love it too. While I have you here, I wanted to show you my Mother's Day present for my daughter. She got me this planter, and these are some proven winter plants that I've got in here. But uh, don't you think it's beautiful, the elephant? I just love it, it's been great. And my son and my daughter-in-law got me a beautiful basket of wave petunias that are purple. I really love them also. See you next time on Garden Rudiments.